Okay, so I couldn't find a video on this, um, so I thought I would make one. This is how to install the MC500 uh, sequencer by Roland um, OS onto a proper uh, double-sided, double-density diskette and using the um, program on this site, rolandmuseum.de. The download's over there. He made it really easy. Um, if you download those, and you'll also need the Omniflop to format the disk properly if you don't want to use your uh, hardware. And you will need a proper um, three and a half floppy drive with the actual controller, not one of the USB ones. Just take my word on that. That's why I'm running this satellite. Okay, so first of all, um, start up Omniflop. And go ahead and click through these. Format disk. Minus A, and I have it selected here. This is the one that worked for me for um, the MC500, original MC500, probably 300 and MK2 and etc. etc. But this is what worked for me. And then uh, hit finish. Blah blah. blah. Insert my disk. Yes, I want to format. I'm aware. So that was successful. Uh, I have the downloaded programs from rollandmuseum.de in here. And I, uh, I have run the Super MRC, the latest version of, or the, the last version of the Super MRC. Um, I did not care for it on the original MC500, which is what I have. It's probably great for the Mark II and uh, after that, but for mine, uh, the lack of memory was a huge problem and slowed everything down really badly. So I'm going to make a disc for the last version of the original OS and see how that works for me. Um, I cannot read that, but we'll try this. I'm guessing that's good. Alright, let's go test it out. See what happens. There we 
we go. Cool. I'm going to give that a try and hopefully I like it better than the, the other one. Alright, good luck. Thanks.